we will expose the book of Leroy from Evangelism today. And I am using this material from this um, beneficial website, trinitytruth.org. I will leave the um, link in my description box. Before I do share and expose this um, deception, I would like us to pray. Father in heaven, I praise you and I thank you that I could expose this uh, anomaly and deception that your people may come out of her false teaching in the seventh day of this church. I pray, amen and amen. Let me share with you this um, article exposing Leroy Fromm's book, Evangelism, Part 1. Evangelism, page 615, paragraph 1, Hib Heavenly Trio. There are three living persons of the heavenly trio. In the name of these three great powers, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit, those who receive Christ by living faith are baptized. Special Testimony, Series B, num number 7, pages 62, 63, 1905, Evangelism, 615, paragraph 1. The Trinitarian mindset assumes that the heavenly trio must be three beings. But who says or says who? A trinity is always three beings, but is a trio, but a trio is not. So let us allow the spirit of prophecy explain the spirit of prophecy. Ellen White taught that the Father and the Son are one in spirit and that the Spirit of God comes to us through His only begotten Son. Thus, she called the Holy Spirit the Spirit of Christ. The Holy Spirit is the Spirit of Christ, which is sent to all men to give them sufficiency. Ellen G. White, Manuscript, Releases 14, 84, Paragraph 3. We want the Holy Spirit, which is Jesus Christ. Ellen White, Letter 66, April 10, 1894. But it is heaven of... But it is the leaven of the Spirit of Jesus, which is sent down from heaven, called the Holy Ghost. Ellen G. White, Manuscript 36, 1891. Since Ellen White says the Holy Spirit is the Spirit of Christ, then she has to be saying the heaven trio is the Father, Son, uh, Holy Spirit, or she would be contradicting herself. Hence, she did not. She did, in fact, write those exact words, proving beyond any doubt, this is who she called the trio. So letting... Spirit of prophecy explains spirit of prophecy. Here is the heavenly trio, according to Ellen White. They have one God and one Savior and one Spirit, the Spirit of Christ, is to bring unity into their ranks. Ellen G. White, Testimonies, Volume 9, 189, Paragraph 3, 1909. The third in the trio, 1 plus 1 plus 1 equals the Spirit of Christ. Many fail to realize that the Spirit of Christ can function like a person, a separate to himself. So it's like another person, though not a literal person, of course. So we, we do not have a heavenly trio, but so we do have a heavenly trio, but not a heavenly eternity. Thus, the Holy Spirit is the power and presence of God and Christ, which can function independently of themselves like a third, but not a th literal third. And this is how they represent themselves, where they are not personally present. Well, who did Ellen White call the heavenly trio? So, Ellen White said the Holy Spirit is the Spirit of Christ. Therefore, she taught the heavenly trio is the Father, Son, and Holy Spirit. The Holy Spirit is the Spirit of Christ, which is sent to all men to give them all sufficiency. So Ellen G. White believes that the Holy Spirit is the Spirit of Christ and the Spirit of God. May we continue to expose this error. And may prove that there are only two beings, the Father and the Son, and their Holy Spirit. The three powers, the three trios, not the Trinity, three in one gods. Three gods in one God. May God's blessing and his Son's grace be with you all, now and forevermore.